Hey guys, it's Kim Kim. My real name's Kim. In case you were curious, thank you for joining me for another video. And if you're the welcome, um, at this point, I just need to stop apologizing because, you know, obviously you guys want changed behavior, <laughs> or at least that's what I would assume. Because I keep coming on here, apologize, and say, oh, I'm gonna be consistent again, and then bada bing, bada boom, I'm a ghost, Casper, if you will. So I'm just. I'm here and I'm doing the best I can. Okay, I have some some pretty some some changes coming soon and I'm super excited. But for right now, we're just gonna continue with our regularly scheduled programming. Um, it is March. It's March fifth. I still haven't told y'all about my empties from last year. So that's what we're gonna do because I'm looking straight ahead of me. And on my, like, chest thing, I have some empties piling up from, like, January to now. And I have to get rid of these so I can put them in the bag. You feel me? Like, I've tried to keep it separate so you guys can know. But at this point, I should just put them all together. I didn't, though. So you will still get your quarterly thing, I guess, like, in April, hopefully. Maybe May. Um, yeah, I'll just have to let you... You'll just see it when you see it. But... I have other videos that I filmed. I think I'm just skip to this one. So y'all will be getting this tomorrow because today is Sunday the 5th. You should be getting this on the 6th. If I post this and it's not the 6th, mind your business. Um, I'm trying to do better, I promise. I need to get better on Instagram. I need to get better on the, on YouTube. I just need to be better. Anyways, <sighs> long talks. Um, I got a, This is a piece of a clip-in on top of my bun from Tamar Beauty Supply. Um, I think I have them linked down below. We have a coupon code. I've done some sponsored content for them on Instagram. And I love their stuff. So yeah, check that out. Um, Mia is eating paper. My girl. What the heck? And it has to be right in the middle of me filming. Whatever, you know, at this point, whatever. So we're gonna finally get into this, okay? The infamous. The infamous empties bag y'all know y'all know the vibes you might not it's been a month <laughs> it's been a real minute um but yeah so i have a mixture of vitamins hair skin we're just gonna get into it so i can get these stuff the recycle bin so i can start you know accruing the stuff from this year okay so we're just gonna start okay um i'm gonna start with these two <laughs> these two ritual bottles I'm pretty sure it should have been four. I have periods of time where I'm like, I'm taking my vitamins every day. I'm drinking my water and we're living life. And then I have the times where I just get up and I refuse to. Not refuse, but like, I just don't do it. I don't know. So I have these two empty ritual bottles. Um, I might have some more other places. Cause like when I travel, I bring it with me. And I usually bring like one that only has like just enough for when I travel. I don't know, but this is what I have right now. I think there might be another one in there. If there is, I'll just let you know, but yeah. It should be like at least three of these or maybe four, only two. Um, when I take them, I feel good. Like, cause when I take them consistently, I can like see like changes, like positive things. But when I don't take it, I don't really realize it. So whatever, they're just multivitamins. Next, I have two of the Undeniable Beauty ones. Y'all are judging me. I feel like you're judging me because I should have more than these. It's, it's for the quarter of the year. Whatever. But um, I have two of these. Uh, they taste really good. I don't like grapefruit, but they do taste good. And when I take them, I do realize a change in my hair, skin, and nails. And when I don't take them, things start to suffer. I'm at that suffering stage right now, and I'm trying to get back on it. I have one of the probiotic and prebiotic for a balanced belly uh, Ollie's um, these also taste good I realize like I just my stomach just feels better when I take these regularly so this is another thing that I'm trying to start taking regularly I'm sorry I'm doing my vitamins again I need to do that. It's the middle of the day. I still have taking my vitamins. I'm trying to get better. But I have been better recently about taking my vitamins at least daily. Just not at the same time every day. I'm trying to get all like the non-hair stuff out the way. Because that's just the stuff that was at the top. So I have this Dove Advanced Care Deodorant. 
it smells nice and clean it's that uh cucumber scent that i love so much um with the body wash like i love that body wash um this works really well i think from what i've used in the last i've pretty much been using this this past year i want to say and i like this the best out of all the deodorants that i've tried it, like it actually like works um so i really like this like i can tell the difference when i have this on versus when i have a different one on and then i have the uhuru naturals whipped body whipped body cream um this is very moisturizing you only needed a like a dab like just j for like your whole arm like i kid you not like it's very easy to get too much of this it's it's i don't know how to explain it because it's not like super de duper thick but like it it lasted you a good bit so when i finished this i was thoroughly impressed that means that i loved it the smell was okay uh, i didn't really have like a strong scent so like i still could like wear my perfume and it would overpower the smell of this so i like that very moisturizing very creamy i would get this again oh and i showed you guys the vitamins clearly i had multiples of pretty much all of them i would buy them again that deodorant i really liked as well and i would most definitely purchase it again i think i already have um next i have the love wellness ph balancing cleanser it's fragrance free um and this is a down air cleaner um i like to get the fragrance free ones now just because i think i'm a little bit more sensitive than i was maybe in my younger years i don't know i'm getting up there so i only use fragrance free now um so i don't get irritated and because that's nobody wants that so like i just you know and when i use this i i could just i felt fresh all day so it's not like it it wasn't like i need a like a scent like this unscented thing made me feel fresh and clean and i smelled fresh and clean so i was like yes so i would most definitely purchase this again this is the beloved green clay and eucalyptus hand sanitizer i love 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 eucalyptus the smell of it i love it i i'm obsessed with it everything that has like a green something in eucalyptus i need to get it this was the best smelling um hand sanitizer i've ever used so much so that like i accused my friend of stealing this like when i lost it and now i can't find them if you guys if anybody has like seen these back in like a target or something please let me know because i got this from target i even checked amazon but i love this so much and i want another one okay and then i have the emerald i can't i don't really know the name of this brand it's like emerald love sony or something like that but this was their tropic fantasy body scrub um and it was amazing i literally felt like i was on a, like on an island by myself every time i was in the shower with this like i felt like i was about to get in the water in my bikini like with with my mango daiquiri like it smells so good and it was like the crystals you can probably see a little bit like the crystals in it are like pretty thick and like coarse so they really actually like you know scrub something and I really like that so my skin always felt super soft and supple when I finished and I smelled really good like the smell kind of lingered a little bit unless you put some that smelled a little bit stronger on top y'all know I love a fruity scent okay next I have these two Nivea uh lotion bottles this is my like everyday lotion. I love it. I use this brand all the time. It keeps me nice and moisturized. Um, and I, yeah, these are the exact same bottle actually. Um, I just love it. This is literally my daily one. I only use like other ones when I'm like doing special things, like if I'm going on a date or if I'm going like, I don't know, just a special event is when I use other kinds, but like on an everyday regular basis, I'm using Nivea and I love it and I stick by it. Clearly I would buy it again because here are the same bottles twice. I think we're finally into the hair care stuff. Thank you for sticking with me through the non hair care things. But we have unfortunately my Curl Days Glossy Shine Gel. If you guys are not new here, you know I am obsessed with this stuff. Obsessed. This is the best wash and go I think I've ever had. And that's why I use this up. I use it up throughout the summer because, like, when I want to just go out and it's hot, my hair is going to dry when I'm outside. This is what I'm putting in my hair. I need some more of this. Um, they're a little bit wishy-washy when it comes to um, being available. Like, whenever I'm in Target, this is always gone and they always have, like, the shampoo and conditioner maybe. I don't want that. I want this. So, next time I see this, I'm going to pick it up. 
if my pocket permits because mm -hmm, I'm on a budget now. Next, I have the Negus Banda Green Smoothie Anti-Shedding Rinse Treatment. This has made in its appearance on my channel multiple times, I believe. I'm pretty sure it has. I love this stuff. I use this with my pre-poos and like when I do like clay treatments and stuff like that as a replacement to water because why not use something that's going to strengthen my hair and reduce shedding versus just water. I love this stuff. I'm obsessed. It doesn't really smell that good, but I love it. Mia is still over there eating paper. Um, and it's at the point where like she she has like a good grip on it. So there's no sense in me even trying to take it from her. Mind your business. I If you're a different kind of pet parent and you'd be wrestling your kids to get that stuff out their mouth, you know, more power to you. I'm not wrestling her for the piece of paper. It's fiber. Anyway, next is the Rosiana Natural Sugar Cane and Almond Moisturizing Shampoo. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, an empty shampoo bottle. That should tell you something right there. This was on my favorites. I don't know if it was this, if 2022 or 2021, but it was a favorite, clearly. I used up a whole shampoo. Exactly. You, if you gave me a round of applause, thank you. <laughs> but shampoo this stuff is amazing my hair was so soft and so moisturized when i finished it but it was also clean and i could wash my hair with this twice and it would not be stripped and like that's that's a feat that is a feat because a lot of times you know these moisturized shampoos are moisturized in the first go around but if you use them again it's like oh, okay okay you kind of a little bit clarifying kind of a little bit stripping now <laughs> but no this one stayed true the whole time so i absolutely love this i use this on my brother's hair i think i used this on my cousin's hair before and everybody said it was just so soft next is this beautified by shauna reviving and strengthening deep treatment i used this in like i use it to make a gloss with their uh they have like a powder type thing clay ish thing that i use to make a gloss with this um two or three times and then I, the last time i think i used it as like a regular deep conditioner um i think i preferred it as like the base of a gloss versus it being its own thing but yeah i don't know um i don't i didn't purchase this but i don't think i would repurchase this um i would just use their powders and mix it with a deep condition that i already have oh and if it was a clear i would definitely buy this again Next is the Pow Main Choice Shampoo. I'm, y'all, another shampoo. I actually really, really like this. I used most of this, but uh, my brother thinks I'm Target and comes in here and asks me like, what product can I have? What product can I have? So I usually check my top um, shelf where I have all of my almost empty products. And those are the ones I give to him because you know, I've had like my fun with them or unless they're my favorites, then I'm not giving them away. But, like, this was almost done, so I was like, fine, you can use this one. Um, I really liked this. Well, I, I'm not going to say I really liked it, but, you know, it was a good shampoo. Um, I use it quite a bit. And, yeah, um, I wouldn't repurchase this. It's not it's not anything special, um, but I did like it, and it smelled really good. Oop, I missed a body product. This is another Emerald Love Sony uh, product. This is their Oh So Sensitive Nani Gel. Um, it's another cleanser. This is really good as well. This did have a scent, but it wasn't strong. And it was like, like I said, I am sensitive down there. So this being a sensitive product, I really felt it. And I, I clearly, like I use the whole thing. Like if something is too harsh, I'm not using it. So for me to have two of these like finished is a good, like that's a good sign. That means that they're really good. And this one is black. Next, I have the Rosiana Naturals Calendula and Aloe Deep Conditioner. <laughs> okay, let me just read you these claims so I can just give you my review and we can move on. It moisturizes, detangles, glides, softens hair, adds shine, and reduces frizz. It did all that. It did all that. I loved it. Um, I think I used this. I don't know. I might have used it on my brother's hair once, but this was me. Like, this was me. Like, I didn't want to share this one too much because this was really good. Like, it's one of those products, like, I would use this and the shampoo in conjunction when I'm like, I just need a good wash day, y'all. Let's just get a good wash day. We don't have time to try new products. Let's get something we know is going to work and moisturize my hair. This is what I was going to. That's why they're empty. <laughs> so, I will most definitely pick up that deep conditioner again as well. 
Next, I have this Ariella Cosmetics Mega Hair Growth Oil. I mean, it was mostly done and then it started to solidify and do some weird stuff. Um, it's an oil. Uh, yeah. I didn't use it enough. Like, I have tons of oils. I still haven't filmed my oil video. Maybe I'll do that today. But, um, I've had tons of oils touch this scalp and this was just, like, it's, it's an oil. I also use it as a pre-poo. Um, and it was cool. So, this is also black-owned. It's an oil, if you like oils, okay? Um, like, I don't really have a full review on it because I didn't use it, like, consistently. So, I don't know. <laughs> Joe, this was one of the top products of 2022, y'all. Um, it is the She Scented Passion Fruit and Flex Charcoal Scalp Detox. This right here was one of my favorite cleansers of 2022. I used it up in like three goes and it was like within a few months, maybe if it made it months. Like as soon as I opened it, I was like, oh, I need this again and again and again. Um, I actually used this the first time like outside the shower, just wetting my hair and, you know, applying it. And I don't think it worked the best. But when I start, I just started to use this like as a co-wash, like when I get in the shower, this is bomb. This is bomb. And it actually cleansed my hair and scalp well. Me is over here hitting my stand, of course. Um, but like it worked really well. It cleansed my hair. Like I didn't feel like after I used this that I needed like a shampoo. And if I did, like if my hair was super dirty, then I would need a shampoo. But I would go in with like a moisturizing one because like this did, this did a good hunk of the work. I, I appreciate it. It held it down. And I love oh, the smell. Smell like a tropical vacation. Can you guys tell that I need a vacation? A tropical one? <laughs> Anyways. This is the Rich Roots Hair Company Organic Lavender Infused Growth Oil. This is another like, I used to mix this with like all of my um, concoctions. Like the ones with the clay and stuff. Just to make it a little bit smoother. And help seal in moistures and all that. You know, all that good stuff. Um, I don't really have a review on it. It's an oil. I liked how it felt on my scalp. It didn't tingle or anything like that. But, uh, I mean, clearly I must have liked it some kind of bit because it's done. And this one is bigger than normal oils, I want to say. So, it's an oil. Uh, I believe that is a black owned brand as well. Next is the pattern styling cream. I really really like pattern scent i don't know what it is but that signature scent i really like it it reminds me of gucci bloom the perfume for the girls that know they know but um yeah that's how it, it reminds me of i know a lot of people don't really like the smell of it i do but whatever um but this cream was moisturizing i really liked it i used it hold on another empty this is the pattern curl gel i used this like kind of as a leave and then put the curl gel on top and my hair was nice and so so moisturized and the definition was crazy like i used this for the wash and go combination and these two girls were giving they were giving i really liked it this gel doesn't like add a harsh crunch and it makes my it like keeps my hair moisturized still like this was the this was like the intense moisture then this came in and like went on top and like helped define my curls but it was still moisturized so i'm loving it <laughs> uh i would i don't know they're kind of expensive i would purchase these if they were on sale i would the she scented um papaya scalp cleanser i would definitely buy that again i would um, I would, I, I hate how I do this. I would also buy the hair rinse from Negus Banda again. I don't need to because I have another one, but that one's almost out too because I use them all the time. Okay, next is the Debutante Beauty Deep Work Deep Conditioner. I really liked this as well. I can't remember if I used this or the shampoo in a video. I really can't remember, but I really like them. I like other products, actually. Mia, leave it alone. I like all of their products, um, and I've worked with them multiple times. They support me. I support them. You know, we love that. Uh, black woman owned. Owner so sweet. Uh, and the packaging is, like, super cute. Like, you can get every little bit of the product out of here, and I truly appreciate that. Um, it smells, like, fresh and clean. I really liked it, as you can see. 
is gone and I would repurchase but I already have another one so next we have the floor and curl soothe me coconut mint scalp refresh pre shampoo oil I'm gonna keep it a buck 200 with you I'm not a fan of floor and curl like I've tried a decent amount of their products like I think I've tried three um I don't it doesn't do it for me it doesn't like it didn't give me any desire to try to try any other because they have like a million products I don't want to try anymore I mean this oil was cool it did you know I think it did soothe my scalp I guess I used it right before I shampooed no I used this and then I would pre-poo with like a thing for my hair like this was for my scalp and I would pre-poo and then I would wash it out um it did I want to say it did have a little tingle um I really just used it up so I could have it in the empties to be honest I will not be revisiting Flora and Curl. Uh, yeah, I don't see it. Unless they come out with something real crazy and that I want to try. Mm -mm. And last but not least, we have the Curl Smith Bond Cur Bond Curl Rehab Salve. The girls, the girls knew what they were doing with this one. Every time I use it, my hair comes out popping like. I had curls I didn't know I had after I rinsed this out. Like, I love this stuff. <laughs> um, I did get this on sale, and I will also buy this again on sale. Mm -hmm. I'm not. I'm not paying full price. <laughs> I refuse. Um, Curl Smith is, from what I understand, not a black-owned brand, and I don't really want to spend um, like twenty-something dollars on a product. Unless I'm supporting, you know, somebody black. Because I'm rooting for everybody black. That's just me. With my hair products, I prefer to put my money towards a black-owned brand. That's just me. You could be different, but that's just me. Um, so, yeah, I do really like this. And I would definitely repurchase it. Just not at full price. <laughs> but I finally reached... I had to check again. I finally reached the end of the bag we are done with our empties from the the last quadrant of 2022 so we can finally move on we can finally move on it's a little late but we can move on so that's all i have for you guys make sure you like comment share subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend tell a cousin to tell a cousin follow me on instagram link is in the description box so is my tiktok please go down there and follow my tiktok um and i have you know codes down below i don't know how many of these products have a code down below but you can check mm -hmm. you can definitely check um and i will see y'all in the next one bye